Good morning. So uh, I'm doing an early start this morning. It's like 6.30. And that's because Mrs. Jezza has a hair appointment in the middle of the day and I'll be looking after MJ. So because I need to record, edit, and have ready the full challenge of the month announcements of winners set of videos, I'm starting early so I can finish off the judging, record, edit, and have it all ready. <laughs> We interrupted this uh, challenge of the month judging session to bring you Daddy and MJ at the park. Yay! Do you want to go on the swings? Yeah. Okay. This is my first time wearing my Jazza shirt in public. It feels a little bit weird. It feels like I'm wearing a t-shirt with my face on it. <laughs> I love the shirt in private in my own house. Just because, again, there's, there's shameless self-promotion, but I feel like this takes it to a new level. Okay, I'm ready to rock and roll. Uh, this is my USB monitor, which I have uh, showing a Canon EOS display program so that I can see on a bigger monitor what shows on this thing. I do have that little window there, which I do use when I'm filming just to make sure I'm making eye contact and see what my position in the frame is like. But uh, the reason I have this open is because I really can't see if I'm in focus or not on that tiny little thing. So I use this to check focus, to check positioning and proportions, and they're both my references. In the meantime, on the computer, I have an audio recorder open, ready for the microphone to be captured. Just before I film, I just thought of something cool that it's totally random, but I just want to show you my genius idea to use this thing. I have this boom arm that uh, I put here that was going to be for a shotgun mic, which to be honest, I haven't ended up really using that much. I think it'd be better for on location stuff. So I just realized I took this thing off and found this lying around. I just realized I can fit this on here. Hang on a sec, let me just push you down. I'm gonna swap this thing out for this thing, which has like more articulation and it's more like it's a camera mount base. Then I can put on my selfie stick head and tighten it. And there you go. Just from random stuff lying around, I have an easy to use phone mount. How cool is that? Yeah. So now, if I want to show you some behind the scenes stuff, I can do so with a little less shakiness and uh, a little more ease of use. And I actually, this might be useful for some other projects when I need a second camera or a third camera. I've had another stroke of genius. This is my miscellaneous crap section of the VR studio. I have these things which turn a single camera cold shoe mount into a double camera cold shoe mount. I got this thing out because I thought of an idea that I can use to upgrade my upgrade. You ready? All right, take off that. Put on this. These are upside down, so I have to flip them. This will be worth it, trust me. Now I can put this thing back on one of these cold shoe mounts. And now on the other one, I can put this thing. Okay, so now what I have <laughs> is a selfie stick head so I can mount the phone in here and I can plug my Rode VideoMic Pro in because I have an adapter cable that turns it into something compatible with my phone. So now, in theory, I can mount it on this thing and get good audio and still shots for my vlogs and maybe even for other miscellaneous stuff. You ready? Let's check it out. Hey, hey, look at that. Ready? 
let's test the articulation. So I can do, I can do occasional like time lapse shots or whatever, and like easily change the angle and position. I can make it low and look up. Oh, look at me not holding my camera. I can bring it all the way over here and do other stuff and turn it around. Oh my goodness. Why am I so excited about this? <laughs> I feel like I've upgraded my studio. Ooh, so cool. See, occasionally I get a little bit of crap from Mrs. Jazza because I have an addiction to collecting lots of fiddly bits and gadgets and buttons and all that stuff. But this is why I love it, because occasionally you'll be like, oh, I have an idea for a thing. And all of a sudden I have some cables and some screwy things that I can make something happen. Yeah. Anyways. This has been a really long procrastination session. This has been a really long procrastination. <laughs> How do you say procrastination session? Procrastin procrast procrastination session. Try and say it. It's really hard. This has been a really long procrastination session, which I'm making longer by trying to say procrastination session. And I need to get to work and start recording. <laughs> G'day ladies and gentlemen. G'day ladies and gentlemen, welcome to Draw with Jazza. I'm Jazza and this video is the showcase and the announcement of the winners for the February 2017 Challenge of the Month entitled Epic Arty Party. I'm gonna wrap up with the question of the day. I'm gonna use my cool camera rig. Oh yeah. Sparkle Dalek asks, why don't you use your music channel anymore? I loved it. Um. For the same reason I don't drum or play games anymore. It's something I love, but I just don't have time to do it. I still love playing music when I get the time, although I don't get much these days. But uh, if you love the music and the music channel, I do have some plans for content that I'd like to start playing around with later this year that may include some music, right? So like a some sort of a music video slash art creation cover mashup. So yeah, if you enjoy my music, I've never done much of it on my main channel. I'm curious to see how it comes over because it's going to be a bit different, but it, it, you know, if you enjoyed my music channel, hopefully you'll enjoy that content. If everyone hates it, then obviously I'm not going to keep doing it. But if everyone loves it, that might be something I might do a couple of times a year or, you know, something like that. Anyways, that'll do for this video. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed my little behind the scenes dive into the the challenge of the month and my fun new gadget. <laughs> Thanks for watching guys and uh, I'll see you tomorrow. I can just walk off now. <laughs>